Hi, I'm Johnny Peacock and I'm working with Simply Health to help keep the nation on top of their health and well-being. This evening we're doing a fun 30 minute workout that you can all do from the comfort of your own home. This is going to be for all abilities, so please guys just try and get off the sofa and get involved. If there's an exercise that you think is just a little bit tough, then just try and adapt it a little bit or maybe just set that one aside and join on the next one. But it's all about having fun getting up, getting involved. We just want to get a little bit of dopamine in our systems, get some happiness, happiness going. And if you stick around to the end, there'll be a little question and answering session. So let's get stuck in. Our circuit here, uh, we're just going to do five exercises. It just makes up part of the circuit that I do uh, a few times a week, just to kind of realign everything and activate it. It's, it's not too hard. And like I say, don't beat yourself up if some of these exercises are a little bit too challenging because they're all adaptable. And yeah, there's, there's also no pressure on it, you know, mix and match. It's really, there's, there's no rules when it comes to exercise. So just have fun with it. So yeah, the first exercise we're going to do is a cool A, um, the B sit-up. Now, this one is probably the most challenging exercise we're going to do. So I'm going to split it up into two sections and you can eventually put it together. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is basically just lift our legs up. That's effectively half of the B sit up. And it's just about really switching on our lower abs here, making sure that back isn't completely curved, but it's also not completely flat. It's nice and neutral. We're holding there and just letting the legs go up and down. The second part of this exercise, obviously, once you're progressing, is just the upper body. So we're just going to go upper body here, arms up and up in front, or arms up above us, I should say. Straight arms, and just coming up. Now, once you nail these two exercises, you've got to show them, we're going to put them together and form the V set up. This is quite a coordination thing, by the way. I find that if you come up at the same time, it makes things a lot easier. If you try and initiate your legs and then try and initiate your arms, or try and initiate your arms and then your legs, it just becomes very dis discoordinated tricky. So this will, this will take some time, but it's really fun um, and a really good hit once you get it. So the V set up, we're just going to create a V. So like that, legs up, hands up. And as you can see, I'm really trying to do this at the same time. I'm trying to pull these together and make sure that it's synced up. And I am meeting roughly in the middle. And we're just going to do about 10 of those. Um, or as many as you feel like that. From that, we're going to flip over because everything here is about tightening and opening. We don't just want to sit here and keep tightening our abs until we're hunched over when we can't do anything. So we need to make sure that for everything that we close, we also open. So with this, we're just going to do back pipers here. So this is really easy. Your hands, they can go behind you, on your back, they can on your temples, on your head, or behind your head, it doesn't really matter too much, or they can just be out to the side. And we're just going to pick our chest off the floor. And again, we're just going to do around about 10 of these. And it's quite simple here. You just try to really lift that chest off the ground. And the range here, don't worry too much about the range. If you can only come up here, that's fine. Really nice to like that. From that position, we're going to come back onto our back and then do some toe touches. Really simple here. Legs up in front of you. These can be tough. Like, I'm not going to beat around the bush here. These can be quite challenging. This is about range. Come to the point that you feel like. You don't have to do touch your toes if you, if you can't. If you can only come up here, that's fine. All we're trying to do is just, this, this is all we need, that tiny little bit of movement, just to contract the abs. So even if we're just here, that's fine. You can sit here and just do it, it's like a little crunch. And again, we're just going to do 10. Or, if you want to, we can go all the way to our toes. Ooh, pretty good, the lower abs that. And again, just get a good pump on it. 